Welcome to the Maryland Suburbs Market Watch, brought to you by Real Estate Business Intelligence and MRIS Company. Let's take a look at the most recent activity in the Maryland Suburbs housing market, which includes these areas. In December, all eyes were on Washington, D.C., gauging the likelihood of an agreement between Congress and the White House to avoid the fiscal cliff. With a partial deal on taxes completed, there are still important unresolved issues, resolving sequestration and raising the debt limit. Partisanship surrounding these issues will produce lingering uncertainty for the next two and a half months. Despite the political wrangling, in December the national economy continued its steady pace of economic growth. The U.S. added another 155,000 jobs. Over the 12-month period from December 2011 to December 2012, the national economy grew by 1.8 million jobs, with growth broadly across the private sector and the unemployment rate held steady at 7.8%. The year ended on an up note for the U.S. housing market and conditions continue to improve. Most experts believe 2013 will be a good year for sellers. Inventories are still low, prices are rising, and underwriting guidelines for new mortgages are becoming more uniform. But the lack of uncertainty on fiscal issues will continue to rein in the potential for a more robust recovery and will likely result in continued slow, though steady, economic growth nationally. Suburban Maryland continues to post modest but steady job growth. About 11,100 jobs were added to the local economy over the past 12 months. The unemployment rate in the Maryland suburbs remains steady at 5.5%. Sales activity in the Maryland suburbs housing market is about the same level as this time last year. There were 1,416 sales in December, down just 0.5% from December 2011. There were 1,495 new pending contracts in December, down 9% from this time last year, the sharpest decline of 2012. The slowed sales and pending sales numbers could signal tempered demand in the near term. The most striking aspect of the 2012 market has been the diminishing supply of homes for sale. Active listings continue to plunge and have fallen to their lowest level since July 2005. There were 3,323 active listings at the end of December, 43% below this time last year. New listings have also fallen throughout 2012. There were 1,206 new listings at the end of December, almost 7% below December 2011. At $263,950, the median sales price is up 16% from December 2011. The low supply of active listings is not only putting upward pressure on the median price, but also influencing the days on market. At 31 days, the median days on market is down 29 days from December 2011. As we continue through the winter months, it's unlikely that a dramatic surge of new listings will enter the market. This should keep upward pressure on prices as long as buyers remain active. However, the scarcity of inventory and the lingering fiscal uncertainty at the national level will continue to influence buyers and sellers and could create drag on the spring market. That's the Maryland Suburbs Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest.